Previously on a trip to the thrift. We're about to depart from Rhode Island, go back on a road trip all the way to Philly, and uh, probably continue the adventure there. Peace. All right, guys, um, we transition into the bins. Um, that's ideally the change I would get in my life, just turning myself into Goodwill bins. But um, I just want to show you guys the finds. As y'all know, man, it's very hard to go through the bins and record simultaneously, but I got some really cool shit. This is what I just found, this competitor, brand new with tags, Philadelphia Phillies crew neck from a 93, nine tray. It's the year of my birth. It's like a little cut and sew right there. Um, of course, I had to grab the Garfield and I found a Polo Ralph Lauren, really sick like onesie for children. And it just so happened to fit Garfield perfectly when you cuff the legs and sleeves a little bit. Got the three right there all embroidered. This dude is fitted. And then it also conveniently enough has snap legs. So the tail also has a place to just bust out the back. And you can hang him up. It gets no better than that. Look at little dude. You better get back, hog cat, and lift them. I think those are Girl Scout patches. Are they? Yo, this one's hard though. This is just like a little stew pot. Bro, I'm about to grab that. Also, I got some other great little finds. I got a Nautica little swim trunk, all embroidered right there. That's very, very crisp eye. I also grabbed a Busta Rhymes wrap tee. As you guys can tell, homie is just enveloped in the flame and showing off his grill, all natural or not, either way. It's still shining, sparkling, and glistening. It's on that old school marina tag right there. And then it says um, flip mode is the squad on the back when disaster strikes. So a little cool rap tee. Got the little dashiki right here in the AKA colorway. So yeah, that little pink and green. I got some ice creams that'll go great with this. I also grabbed two Michael Vick jerseys. This one in the red color scheme, bro, if you guys used to play Madden 04, Mike Vick was like the truth on that bitch, like straight up. Get you, get you. Oh my get God. You. <laughs> get you. Um, I know a lot of y'all are young, so you probably don't even recall that or were alive then. That's crazy to think about. You also have this Detroit Lions all over print crew neck with the straight up Mufasa diving through the lettering. Got a little script on the bottom. Uh, 1993 as well, dude. That hoe is vicious looking. Lions just draped from one sleeve all the way to the next. I also grabbed the Aquaberry uh, Columbia Bugaboo jacket. It has a fleece zipped in. I know you guys probably can't see stuff as well because it's like all crumpled up in the cart, but that colorway is hard straight up. It matches what I'm rocking right now. Um, then I grabbed another Mike Vick jersey. This one's all black, but it's really cool because it does have the uh, helmet on the sleeve right there. And then I got a little bit of Tommy for your mommy. You guys already know little button up and it has the flags and the little flagships uh embroidered or flagship flags that's repetitive and then i also got that ho 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 bitches um mickey mouse pants as well so stay tuned next year's christmas special is going down but yeah man those are the bin spines absolutely crazy i'm tired as hell bro we got like no sleep to pull up here um but yeah dude this is probably the best find in my opinion, aside from the dead stock competitor crew neck that Garfield, of course, goes hard, draped up in that polo. My God. Y'all let me know, is this a must cop, the gently used lotion? Mmm, what scent is it? Oh, winter, something with a K. Rose. Oh, my fault. It's an R. Stupid. <laughs> Yo, bro, what are those? <laughs> Peep game, these are actually really dope. They got the like dead stock lugs, and I think they're low key like clear. Oh no, they're not, fuck. But they give the mystique as if they are windows. I would cop these, but this guy is just shedding its outer layer. Um, so that definitely is cool. They also got like a Campbell's, mm-mm, good. Max in North Carolina trucker hat. Well, this thing just has all types of residue flying off of it. Casey, what did you get? Yeah, I'm here with the lovely Casey as well. I don't know, I just found these really clean. Coach jackets, yeah. They're just like nice little like throw over, I don't know, wear them with whatever. They're both the same. A little mustard and ketchup dynamic. And then I found these Ralph Lauren corduroy pants because you know corduroy is cool. Corduroy is Kinky's least favorite material, just FYI. He's trippy. Oh, these boots are cool. 
They're like leather red boots. I've been looking for red boots. Hey, these are bloody shoes. Just this cute little bit. Ooh. And then I thought this was kind of funny. Well, cute. It's like a little NHL jacket with the Flyers logo on it. Oh, Icy as a hockey ring, Philly nigga, I'm flyer. All right, we're loading up our finds. Yo, uh, honestly, we're here an hour, and I'm beyond satisfied with Garfield, let alone all the other stuff to add on top of it. So, great day in the bins. Shout out to the Delaware Yeah, we really out here, baby. You already know what time it is. Look at this guy. Oh, parcels and delivered. What a day. Man, look at this little guy. Man, he's ready for a day full of adventures. As am I, son. As am I. <laughs> Don't make me come back there, boy. Alright, sorry for the lack of transition, but we hopped in another Goodwill. It's like mad windy outside, but this store is lit and it is huge, 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 huge. Oh my god, Elmo got his wig split. Who would do that to him? It's hard to deal with the pain of losing you everywhere I go. But I'm doing it. How is this an actual Adidas tee? Like, they got the Adidas American Wedgie collab, like. Mm -hmm. What? Sweat. Bro, why is this sweater so freaking hard though? Coating embroidery. <gasps> no, the Eminem luggage. Yeah, that's for Vinny right there. And it's a backpack. Say, I was three about to bucks. Say, I have to get it for him he wants a suitcase. Nice. Dude, check out this gym I got, man. This was straight on a rack they just pulled out. It's that OG Nike Portugal jersey. It has that little Team Nike tag right there. I love these green sleeves with the maroon, like a very rare color scheme, bro. All embroidered. Oh my god. That's fantastical. Balling like I'm in the NBA. Oh, dude, look at this guy, man. Straight off Clifford's back. You got that Tommy Trill figure V neck. Oh, man. Shout out that cleavage in style if you do have high breast issues. Um, also, shout out the homie Chuck. He's right there. Um, he just ran up on me and show love, so I appreciate that. But yeah, I'm gonna have to go through all these and make final decisions because um, unfortunately, I feel like this guy will take up a ton of space, but it's just so sick. It's unfortunate when I don't have the whip. Whoa, look at this. Champion spell out crew neck, or hoodie, excuse me, with that embroidery on the front. Bruh. I'll take it. Yo, look at my hat. And look at these shorts. Yo, so this is the homie Chuck I was telling y'all about. And look at this gym he just found. Oh, 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 oh. Dylan. Damn. <laughs> dude, that's heat, bro. Oh my god. I can't see you, Stevie Wonder, these haters, dude. This shit's crazy. Sheesh. All right, what up, what up, what's up? Um. Is that time once again, people is raining. I'm back in Houston from this uh, Boston, Rhode Island escapade. And I'm outside this family thrift center by the airport. I have never been here. It says now open, so I assume it's new. But um, yeah, man. Oh my God, class. So there's some major drip in this big ass, brand new um, used clothing store, you dig? But I found like four crazy things just in one section already. You got the Galapagos, Mr. Darwin himself, you know what I'm saying? Shout out all the creationists worldwide getting their dreams shattered by my boy. Um, but yeah, it's like an all over print. It's two dollars. So copying. I also got this like shroom addict little drug abuser tea Of course one dollar copying dude RIP to that shirt though And then I grabbed two jerseys the four dollar Adidas Colombian Soccer jersey and this is a hometown heater. You got the World Series in 05. I remember I was in sixth grade bullying um, Houston Astros all embroidered majestic jersey no stains whatsoever for a decent price of seven bucks you already know what time it is that's a home run boy i'm starting the day off right i woke up at like 5 a.m to catch this flight so um yeah it's early as hell i'm out here trying to find some steals and deals in the trenches oh yes sir very very nice find baby this is a goal found this very nice find a ronaldinho era brazilian soccer jacket as you guys can see it's all embroidered with the patchwork got brazil seal seal on the sleeve and the five stars like a general very very nice i'll take it six bucks 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. I know they do not, but yes, they do, bro. They got the young rich niggas. Bad and bougie robotica erotica hoodie? Bro, which way? That way. Subway, you fresh. Five dollar foot long. Um, yeah, I'm gonna grab this guy, man. It's like six bucks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, also, look at this guy right here. Just like layers of toilet paper. Dude, I thought that was like fucking zippers, but it's not. But it is a $13 big old swoosh on the back. Um, gray. Well, it's not gray. That's navy and white little Nike piece. Okay, very clean. A little piping going all throughout. Nice. Nice. Uh, yeah. And then you also have this little floral encrusted aqua berry piece too that's like five bucks oh shit to go with my jack you got that kodak black exclusive the aqua berry ski mask man because everybody got a's around here dog. oh my god no they don't yo dead ass is two bucks um cop i gotta perform these heists in style bitch grail baby straight up grail acquired i saw my last one in atlanta but you guys know we back and what do i hate i hate a goofy especially i hate a goofy especially yeah dig you got the goofy with the extendo brim and buck teeth oh my god look at those ears straight up draped up and dripped at four dollars oh man that's my dog for show sure. that is my dog for show sure. my dog my dog. Oh no, is it too good to be true? Right next to the heads up party game. Hey, that thing goes hard. High key. You got the goofy straight up blowing the tuba. Oh, uh, that's not what that is at all. But look at this man, little Disney Paradise Cup. I hate a goofy especially. Oh, oh. No, they don't. Bruh, right next to the Easy Bake microwave. It ain't the oven. We didn't have enough money for all that. We just settled for the microwave. They got the Minnie Mouse vintage snapback trucker hat. Bro, this thing is super old school, but them lashes lasted, you dig? See, a lot of you bitches getting them cheap ass, like, non-reusable lashes. Mm-mm, not many, baby. These things are forever, baby. Bro, y'all cannot tell me this is not a fucking vibe. Like, look how good this hat fits on the head. It's like it's meant to be. I would jack it, but they went ahead and put the magnetic little, uh, hater proof theft proof monitoring system on it so unfortunately i'm gonna have to pay for this all four dollars but you know what i'm saying trap hat yo i swear to god this is like if sully and the cookie monster cookie had a baby <laughs> this would be the result of their fucking dude 63 dollars and 60 cents i'll take it check that out yeah you see me brother yeah yo we got the hat secured and the bag secured yeah hey some little girl was like mickey meet up mickey in the store i was like hey girl this mini don't get it twisted or confused yet yeah, egg but um yeah dude i'm very glad i stopped by this store i've been out of houston for like a week so coming back in the city and finding all the great thrift finds is definitely idyllic uh let's proceed to the next all right guys we're in the next store right now and um i have to say man i've stumbled across a few gems that are red dead redemption themed you have this black pearl snap button up with the embroidered eagles these are definitely more like a cartoonized type of style but this is a really clean essential i might not even get rid of this shirt um you got another one this guy is like wrangling some golden bulls Oh yeah, and where I get rid of clothes that don't fit me is thrifthavenvintage.com. The link is down below, so go ahead and bless yourself, Thrift Heaven. Amen. Oh dear God, what a blessing. This shirt combines two of my favorite things, Jesus and Looney Tunes. Jesus is the tweetest name I know. <laughs> yeah, I'm copping this biblical bird. Amen. Bro, tell me why the sweater section is booming right now. This looks like some Skittle vomit or maybe like tropical starburst um, vomit. You got this Nautica hand knit. They were really going ham in the sweatshops. Little, um, I don't know, like cranberry sauce encrusted crocheted sweater. Nice. And then you also have another hand knitted Nautica piece. This one is that plaid design. Um, if you guys try to cop a hand into piece nowadays, they will go for a pretty penny, and each one of these is only two dollars. Yes, sir. Join la resistance des drugs. Yeah, I'm French. You got that uh, vintage dirty right here. Got that super old school Hanes best tag on it, and you also got a Tammy for your mammy little essential in the form of this yellow T-shirt. Mm, I love that thing. 
Oh yeah, and if you guys are trying to add some spice to your sex life, look no further than the Tabasco collab with the fishes that get you hella bitches, big mouth bass, large mouth bass. It's a bass. But yeah, this thing is definitely sick. And uh, yeah, I gotta cop this guy, man. Hey, any fish will go after that Tabasco to get them hoes. Know that. Oh yes, hands down the best equipment is bum equipment, straight up. Oh, holy hell no, nah, hell yes. Look at this, bro. They got the Fila Smash Tennis Full Track Suit. Jesus Christ. It's in the colorway of the interior of a 90s Jack in the Box. Mm, you come home with me. Oh, yes, sir, indeed. Hey, man, check this out. You guys think it's just a clean little essential stripe tee? Well, it is, and that's why I grabbed it. But upon a closer inspection, look at what's embroidered on that tit. Barely legible, but it does say Bitch, you guessed it. Woo! You, you was right. right. Yeah, this is a clean ass guess USA piece, and it's a personal collection cop. Mm. Oh, fuck yes. This moistens my trousers. Look at this, a Mickey Florida. Look at that, man. You got the green on the inside, gray on the outside. Look at that. Fucking. You want a backhanded high five? I don't even know, but I love his stance and I love the color scheme. Yo, yeah, yo. Yeah. Made in USA. Oh yes, son. I came to the women's section just to peep the shoe fire. You know, they got these little Gucci loafer things for elves because these look like they're elf sized. But yeah, look at these things, man. I do not know if these are authentic or not. All I know is they are very tiny and have severe toe drag. So I guess someone was like crib walking um, in these shoes or doing some other forms of dancing, if you will. But yeah, I'm gonna leave these guys because someone's gonna be blessed by some $2 Gucci shoes tomorrow when they come in here. You dig? And fucking psych. So I ended up copying the Gucci shoes um, in the thrift just because I figured at some point in time I will need to buy my woman a bag or some clothing or basically just an expensive gift to save my ass in times of trouble. And why not give her the $2 Gucci shoes? Will they fit? Who knows? Fuck it though. So anyways, if you guys enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm gonna be at SneakerCon, um, Fort Lauderdale in Florida on February 2nd, which is this upcoming weekend. Unless you guys are seeing this really far in the future, then it's not. But yeah, pull up on your boy. I'll have a booth. I'll be here with a ton of gear. So show some love, and I will show it back, baby. <laughs> Peace and love. Live the dream. Eat that ice cream. I'm gone. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life, I roost them And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to